Hey everybody, it's me, LaRasha, Goddess Queen, Just Me 23. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select all so you're notified when I do post on this channel. So this is going to be a general reading. We're going to see what falls out when it comes to this reading. I don't have a certain topic. We're just going to see exactly what does it lead us to when we use the tarot cards and whatever deck else deck that I'm going to use. And then on top of that, make sure you do check out my brand new deck which is called a, a, I remember the time deck it's available for pre-order for the collective thank you to everybody that has already ordered the deck for pre-order this is my copy that I'm using just to show everybody and display the beautiful cards on the table and see exactly how the energy is for this deck so again you can catch this um, deck if you were available to you know if you want to buy it at www.goddessqueenjustme23.com and my Etsy shop which is goddess queen just me um available for pre-order also make sure you subscribe to what's the chat Arasha, where i do the treasure box readings as well as build a nation by word of mouth where i will be using that channel for my campaigning um for president okay um so again let's go ahead and start the song that's in the background is that's what I like by Bruno Mars. Okay, so make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Okay, so let's see. So general reading for the collective. General reading for the collective. General reading for the collective. All signs. General reading for the collective. Uh-oh. Some cards already flew out. We're going to put them back in the deck. But I see the Nine of Swords, the Magician, the Three of Wands, the Ace of Swords, and the Two of Wands. Okay, so somebody could be trying to make a decision on how they're going to go towards you as far as approaching you with an offer. This could have been somebody that did betray you in the past. There was some type of chaos or a destruction that was towards your relationship, regardless if this is a lover, a friend, or a family member, okay? Um, so we have general reading for the collective, general reading for the overall collective, all signs. So that card wants to pop out. We have the Seven of Wands. We already seen this card today. So yeah, clash of the people getting in the way, standing in the way, right? Your masculine, are you not defending yourself the way that you're supposed to or not defending your journey, right? So it says defending and standing up for yourself, being protective and protecting what's yours, protecting what's yours by any Thing, means necessary by any means necessary right so it says uh settling setting boundaries in a relationship so somebody could be setting boundaries you could have set boundaries with your masculine or like i said he's finally setting boundaries with family members friends or lovers and enemies right so it says uh holding your own and maintaining control being pressured or under attack okay so being pressured and under the attack he's tired of being under attack again somebody could have said something verbally that caused your masculine or caused you to feel like you were under attack or like i said they could have said something that was distasteful that was not of your liking right or your masculine's liking where he's like oh no i'm not gonna let you get by on this one you ain't gonna bad mouth me or my divine feminine or anything that she doing because you see her over there you know being flawless she is the motherfucking pressure and for you to come into my space or come into my and if this is you divine feminine you for you to come into my space speaking badly that lets me know that you was not for me and that's all you was meant to do was to attack me my divine feminine in our journey so i feel like somebody's coming in and expressing the truth they could be telling you about who was the people that was trying to attack y'all's journey and this person could have not was you know did wasn't defending y'all's journey the way that he was supposed to okay or she was so it says ace of swords this represents aquarius libra as well as gemini so it says gaining mental fulfillment and clarity realizing the truth of the matter ready to speak and communicate making the right decisions breakthroughs and new plans so somebody got some new plans because again they tired of the naysayers they tired of the the wolves in sheep clothing, the snakes in the grass. Again, now they're setting the necessary boundaries that they needed to set with these family members and his friends and then also setting boundaries with
with themselves, not falling for temptations as drugs, lust, alcohol, things like that. Self-doubt when it comes to doubting just, you know, the y'all's destiny, doubting who he is and who you are, right? Really finding meaning in the truth and gaining the clarity so he can cut away the bullshit, okay? We have the seven of cups. So you see how he got his bow and arrow focused here and it's seven cups uh, total, but there's a total of five over there. So it could have been five people that was trying to block you and your masculine's cup. And he over here is locked and loaded. He ready to be the motherfucking warrior and take everybody down. His sword right now, whatever your masculine is saying to these people is cutting <laughs> his words right now as sharp as a motherfucking sword and his actions he couldn't he got his sword up he cutting away everything and anyone okay that is sitting here coming to with negativity is what i'm hearing so it says seven of cups it says living in illusions it says fantasies it says having multiple options and choices it says uh dumbing down and being brainwashed it says using one's imaginations vivid and lucid dreams are deja vu moments so again he was wearing the rose colored glasses he was causing you know uh choosing other people other situation other things um you know before himself as well as his journey he was doing certain things that he knew was not right which just caused him to be in this self-sabotaging energy your masculine or you could be having vivid dreams lucid dreams having deja vu moments standing up wide awoke you know reflecting on again attacking he could also be thinking let's say if your masculine or the feminine got into a physical fight or got into verbal const uh consultation like a verbal um confrontation with somebody right if there was a, a confrontation with you or your masculine and somebody else he could be reflecting on that like damn i should have stood up at that time or if he did walk away and allowed somebody to say something and didn't defend you or him he's like shit i should never did that but i feel like he is no longer wearing the mask that he was wearing before he even cut off his own mask with that ace of swords in the universe came in and cut it off to help him cut it off you have the nine of cups so now he's seeing that this is wish fulfillment it has always been wish fulfillment you have always been this masculine's you know greatest desires right um so you have nine of cups so it says everything you wish for is coming truth it says receiving award or achievement it says having self-respect and self-love living the good life and being in the spotlight it says being intimate and making love so he could be coming straight to you and telling you hey i'm ready to make the i feel like this is going to be a little bit aggressive you know love making that you and this mask is going to have because i feel like there has been some distance let's say if he did choose other people that he felt that was better than you sexually and intimate that didn't get anywhere it just caused him to have you know uh chaos with Within himself he was under attack possibly because he was dealing with succubus incubus jazebel spirits is what i'm hearing and now he like fuck that that's bad energy over there do not put my pp back in that <laughs> is what i just heard as if your masculine saying you got the page of pinnacle so now they coming in with this offer okay so now they want to cater to you now they see again the potential in this relationship now there's a change when it comes to maturity when it comes to your masculine with you as well as with your journey so it says Page of Pentacles is Capricorn, Taurus, as well as Virgo energy here, right? So it says setting good habits and morals. It says financially, uh, financial offers has arrived. Reconnecting with the earth and grounding yourself. It says seeking higher learning and knowledge starting off small but thinking bigger so like i told you he started off small there's a change as far as when it comes to maturity when it comes to the relationship between you and this masculine now he's realizing again like i told you i have to give to her or i have to put in the necessary um you know time and energy in order for my divine feminine or my divine masculine to see that i'm really dedicated to this relationship so somebody's getting ready to take some type of action towards you and the action that they're taking towards you is the ace of cups again huh, here's my cup let me go back and pick up that cup everybody else was telling me to deny that cup that's the cup that was actually rightfully mine and i was overlooking it okay i hope that she take this love offer here i come right so it's ace of cups so it says emotionally awaking in love new or old lover approaching it says emotional gesture and affection it says my feelings are involved love offer that brings good news so somebody's your masculine's coming in with this love offer you got the ace of swords and the ace of cups so this is again 
faded events that's happening again the universe is causing this masculine to come in and express his truth on how he truly feels again his feelings have always been involved he was allowing other people to peer pressure him and allowing other people to attack him out of his own position okay so again it could have been a capricorn they could have let go of a capricorn that could have been in the way right a capricorn he could have gave a, a the wrong love offer to a capricorn because this represents capricorn there could have been two capricorns that could have been involved in a certain situation as well so somebody is letting go of the unnecessary toxic behavior toxic people again cutting the motherfuckers out my sword is sharper my words is sharper than 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 ever ever right now right so now like i said he's not holding back he's saying the things that he needs to say and cutting out who he needs to cut out because it's not good for him so we got reverse in capricorn it says free from restraints and bondage it says reclaiming control and stability letting go of the dark side and ways dark-sided ways it says breaking uh, bad habits, overcoming difficult situations and addictions. So there could have been drugs, alcohol, money addictions, lust that was in the way that was causing this masculine to wear the rose colored glasses when it comes to y'all's connection. Now that motherfucking veil is off, right? The, 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 the sheet or whatever, the blindfold is no longer over your masculine's eyes. He's seeing through all the people's bullshit. If it was other people that was in the way. And this other person, like I said, it was just negative energy. He said, I need to stop putting my pee pee inside this bitch. And he possibly told this person, I don't want to have sex with this person no more because every time I have sex with you, I feel like I'm getting attacked by dignities. Are you sure you ain't no succubus incubus? And that could have been some cutting words that your masculine could have told, asked this person that he was involved with. And she was like, looked at him like, what is that? And he was like, never mind. Nah, I can't, I can't sleep with you no more. So you got the King of Swords. So yeah, I feel like he's seeing the truth and the character of whoever he was around, family and friends and whoever it was that he was sleeping with. So it says the King of Swords. So it says having structure and mental discipline before he didn't have discipline with himself. It says being in, being in your intelligence. It says communication and conversations coming soon. It's have, having a logical outlook and it says high standards in love. So now he has high standards in love. He said, fuck these succubus, incubus, Jezebel spirits that was just draining me and causing me to, 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 to be in this burdensome situation. These motherfuckers was deceivers. So he was like, oh, no. Nah like i said i'm putting my people in the wrong bitch this bitch is a deceiver she was wearing a mask this whole time and you know they this person was sabotaging my journey i got to get this person up out of my way i gotta cut this off again yeah hey no hard feelings little mama or no hard feelings you know daddy or whatever but i got to go so it says seven of swords having hidden motives agendas plotting and scheming um, it says on one on someone or something being deceptive and sneaky, dangerous, risky behavior and playing mind games. This was risky business for your masculines to entertain these lower negative energies that didn't get him anywhere. Right. One more card. And we have the Ten of Cups. Yeah, you this masculine's wish fulfillment. Now they coming in. Like I told you, they coming in. They don't want to be left out in the situation. They don't want to leave you out in the situation. You are this masculine's right direction. And I told you, they're getting ready to seek the right direction. Now this masculine knows that who, you know, what is the right path that he's supposed to be taking. And he's not supposed to be taking the right path with these succubus incubels succubus incubus jazebel spirits and these family members that are wolves in sheep clothing because again all it was doing is just causing this masculine to not be on the right side of his energy it's not allowing him to defend himself the proper way now your masculine is going back to protecting himself protecting his bubble and if he protects his bubble he knows he's protecting you because divine feminine that's something that you have been doing now he sees you as the real wish fulfillment you are the real his real happiness okay so we have ten of cups it says extremely it says extreme happiness and wish fulfillment taking things to the next step romantically dreams are dreams coming true and becoming one's reality destiny working in your favor it says having love and support in the right places so now you have always been the right place where this masculine is supposed to be and he's coming 
he cut out everybody else and he's like i got one cup and i got my voice and i'm getting ready to come in and tell her how i really feel you have the knight of cups energy here and the ten of cups the ace of cups the ace of swords and the page of pentacles the devil card is is reversed so that letting you know the reversal energy is better because they let shit go okay um and i'm gonna go ahead and end this reading this masculine is happy with you you are his true rainbows lollipops sunshine enjoy everywhere okay love y'all and y'all be safe